So I was talking with a friend of mine uh, that I've known for about 20 years, and he ha happens to be the principal of this school. Uh, and he has a real heart for the people, and he lives here in Hawaiian homes. And um, we we're just trying to find a way to make this school uh, more exciting for the students, um, something that would tie the community and their culture, their history, their background, all of those things. Uh, we want to make it a stronger presence here on campus. And when we started talking more about it, this is, goes two years back, um, I said, man, why don't we just do a mural? You pick a wall and, uh, and we'll come up with a plan and we'll do something really exciting and special for, uh, for the community up here. First thing is I wanted to get the energy and reflect the energy that the students have. So I tied in the, the surf theme for the students. Um, I tied in uh, Paniolo because uh, we've got the, the rodeos that go on up here. It's a huge part that makes um, Makawao special compared to many other the communities on the island. Um, and then I wanted to make sure that we represented um, Haleakala in the background because that's, that's where they live. That's a big part of the identifying the, the culture and the community. And then uh, from my own personal experience, you know, I've been to a, a, a lot of huge events in Hawaii. Um, and one of the most important assets of that or components of that is, uh, is the Hawaiian blessing. And uh, they always are blowing the conch shell. And that's something that goes back into ancient Hawaii days. And so I really wanted to in include that, not just included in the mural, but I wanted it to be a, a huge portion of it, which is why I uh, put together a large silhouette of that happening right below Haleakala. And it's the very first thing you see when you drive around to drop off your student in the morning. It's something that um, lets the students know this is a special place. They're, it's a place that has been blessed for them. It's an area that they, um, they, they shouldn't take lightly. They should appreciate it. And, um, and that's just, those are just some of the elements that I've included into this, uh, this, this piece of work. It wasn't all just my idea. I came up with the sketches after talking with the staff at the school. We had the Hawaiian culture teacher overlook the plans. And then ultimately, on the plane ride over, I picked my color choices. And then, uh, you know, then we head right down to Lowe's, explain to what's going on, and they really helped us get the, match the exact colors I wanted for the project. Um, because that's, that's just as important as everything else on this piece. The, my artwork is never about me. It's always about a much bigger picture. I feel blessed to be able to uh, provide artwork for people and, and connect with them on that level. This has to do with, with so many different people and it's all about the students. It's all about the community. Many mahalos to the, the Hurley company. They've donated $1,000 for not for this mural, but just for the students to be able to buy art supplies in their classroom. Um, the, the students and the staff that helped me, even moving ladders around, splattering paint with me, we had a great time. Um, Principal Shim for coming up with the idea and, and sharing it with me and exploring it with me the whole time. Uh, Lowe's, True Value, uh, Ace Hardware, there were a lot of people involved. So I'm Jeff Albright um, in Makawao and Maui. This is Kalama Intermediate School.